Hello everyone, welcome back to Network Exploit and I am Paswati Banya. Today I'll be the mentor in this video. In this video, in this video we are going to talk about the data set of the malware where can you found the data set and I have collected some of the data set uh, and some of the link that where you can find the data set for the malware and as we know that it's very hard to find the that large amount of data set while doing the experiment uh, with the malware uh, while uh, analyzing uh, detecting and we know how to we must know how to prevent uh, the malware uh, for that purpose we need to do the analysis of malware and for that analysis we need to find a data set and finding data set will be the hard if you don't know the exact uh, the way to find and I have collected some of the name of the website where you can find a large number of data set for the malware and the first website is the virus share uh, it is a collection of malware samples with over two, uh, 2 million samples and this is a huge amount of samples of the malware where you, uh, you can download and you can test it okay and in number two I have malware data set by Microsoft which is gained by the Microsoft and in that sample a data set of a malware sample are connected by the Microsoft Defender uh, ATP as you already familiar about the Microsoft Defender and Windows 7, 8 and 10 there might be the uh, window defender in your by default window defender which prevent from the different kind of malicious uh, so uh, Microsoft uh, has their own data set of the malware and if you search malware data set by the Microsoft you will find a huge amount of data set don't worry about the uh, website or the name of uh, the data set where you can search the malware I will be putting inside the de descriptions okay don't, don't worry about that and the third one is the mal genome project uh, is a data set and third one is the genome project and this is the third one for the data set of the malware uh, it's a data set for, of malware for more than thousand malware samples uh, in the p format okay and there is a format okay for the data collections and the mal genome project uh, is collection about the more than thousand ten thousand malware samples uh, which is format of how it's in the format of p and there is a fourth one uh, data set uh, where you can find the malware is a driven data set and uh, or that it is a driven data set connect it collect the android malware uh, and actually know that the malware uh, come into the android and um, windows most of the malware so if you are working uh, for the android malware you can go to the driven data set and find the android malware which contain more than 5000 samples okay and there is a uh, contagio malware dump uh, it's really hard to pronounce the pronounce the word <laughs> because it's, it's really hard to pronounce this. so no, don't worry about the pronunciation but i will be giving you the in the distributions okay in the name and data sets and the contagio malware dump uh, is a collection of a uh, malware sample uh, which is uh, which have a uh, 1400 samples uh, which can you easily download okay and the sixth one is ember is a collection of data set with the more than 1 million windows portable educatable file including both ping and malicious sample okay and the inside the ember database you will be finding more than 1 million okay 1 million windows portable educatable file okay and the seventh one is the cica uh, cic and mal 2017 data set it is also a collection of android malware data set which contain more than 10,000 samples <laughs> and the uh, eighth one is the botnet database uh, data set for a network traffic uh, which is generated by the boat including both things and the malicious traffic okay and here i have sent you i have said with you with this uh, data set which can be used for the various purposes such as developing and testing malware detections 
algorithm analyzing the behavior of the malware and understanding the technique used by the malware's authors so guys we came to the end of this video uh, yes uh, in this video i have tell you about you the data set of the malware and where the data set are are and where we can find the data set of the malware so guys see you in the next video hope you guys like this video okay guys see you in the next video bye bye good time